Hello and welcome back to Farming Simulator 19. Uh, it's Andrew of Border Farm Games and I'm coming at you with another mod spotlight. Uh, I don't know about your area but in my area the weather is absolutely garbage so there's no better time than this one to do some nice mod review. And today's feature presentation is the brand new Cat Challenger MT800 Old Series by the great Sid Modding himself. Yeah, he finally released this. If you follow his Facebook, um, you could have seen his screenshots for months now, and uh, he's finally uh, out with this one. He snapped and said, Okay, you guys can have it, and this is real great. Uh, now, I would like to point out before you get worried, if you follow the events, yes, it's still with Giants, uh, and it's going to be available for consoles uh, sooner or later. So if you are a console guy, do not fret, be patient, you will get this one uh, most definitely. Uh, so, as you can see, there is the option to open the door. This is something that uh, Giants requested from Sid, uh, and he did comply. Uh, and as far as I know, it's already back for uh, testing with, with uh, all the things Giants requested fixed up. So, it's just a matter of time that you get this beast. Before we take it for a spin, uh, let's let's check out the store because this uh, this mod has more option than, uh, than than stars on the night sky seriously so let's have a look at it so it's under large tractors obviously uh, and it comes with okay so you can modify the weight brackets and for some reason the um, the quick coupling at the end is, is tied to this one, so uh, or so I noted. So you can go with all sorts of things, like up to up to a hundred and and uh, not hundred, uh, fifteen hundred kilograms, and then you can go without uh, the quick coupling. So yeah, there's there's all sorts of options like that, uh, and then. Uh, you have several designs for the uh, for the the exhaust tip, seriously, and and the exhaust in general, uh, and then you can have a GPS. Uh, so that is that is uh, something, and then the 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 engine options are are almost infinite because. It starts from the smallest cat option that it, that gives you 100 and 350 horsepower uh, up to 570, and then uh, things get real wild when the challenger options come uh, because they go up uh, uh, the at least the later ones I guess or I I I have no idea up to 600 horsepower like the nice uh, pink one that that paint that paint scheme that is there to draw attention to um, uh, breast cancer and I'm rolling this one today because why not uh, then of course you have uh, options to cover the engine several of them actually uh, and then you have wheel setups uh, for days, because uh, there is there is a standard track, then the standard track in three meters edition, then you have the cat track, and that in three meters edition again, and then you have all the, this with weights, uh, or and then you have a row crop option. So seriously, you guys can. Uh, uh, do that for days, and then there is this uh, uh, challenger light option, which is called, which is under GPS configurations. Don't ask why. Uh, and then it comes with challenger GPS as well. So there's that. 
Oh, I okay. I know that global position. This this bracket is because I have the uh, what's its name um, the the guidance steering mode. So you won't get it unless you have that one installed. Okay. So this is this is what you find in the store. So far, so good. Now, what's going to happen for the test spin? I have this flexi coil here, which is uh, a mod, and it it. Is, it works as a plow practically. Now I don't know if there is such a thing in real life, or fle uh, the flexi coil is just a, a cultivator in in real life, um, and I don't really care because I figured that this one takes the punch uh, or the juice, and I want to see how much juice this this bad boy can offer, or this bad lady in that case because now it's a it's it's all pink. Uh, guys, remember, uh, breast cancer is a bad thing. Uh, okay, so let's unfold uh, this beast of an implement and let's let's fire up the engine. Let's appreciate the engine noise for a while. All right, uh, but how about we? Appreciate it while putting that beast in the ground. I don't know if this is a different engine noise than the the base game one, but it's quite lame to be honest. Uh, other than that, this is I I've been waiting for this beast uh, ever since I first set eyes on on it, uh, and and a huge thanks goes for Sid. Uh, to Sid for coming through with this. Sorry, guys, I keep correcting myself, uh, even though it's it's summer holiday for me. Yeah. So and it seems to seems to to uh, yank around this huge uh, implement with no problem. Uh, mind though that this this uh, uh, this is a 600 horses engine option and the listed horsepower requirement of this equipment is is 500 so there shouldn't have uh, been any problem and there isn't any so yeah there's that and the the tracks are already nice and dirty just the way we like it uh, so everything's fine over here And while I'm not too excited about this paint scheme, uh, regardless re less of the implications it carries, um, the the beast it, in itself looks absolutely stunning. Uh, and it's so great to have it in my sticky hands, and so so can you have it. Uh, because uh, I will link Sid's Facebook page in the description. You can find the download link there. It's I think it's the fairest way to get it uh, from his original uh, link. Mm. You can find it everywhere around the internet, but I'm not sure it's it's uh, it's his original download link. Uh, except if it's on Yes Mods, I haven't checked that one. That, then they most probably kept uh, Sid's link. But anywhere else, I don't know. So I will link his Facebook. Uh, that's the that's the fairest thing to do. Uh, let's let's take a turn over here. Let's see what, what happens if we turn around. Now this is where we are starting to lose some some speed, but that's all right. So so you can get 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 this from there. Uh, if you're wondering where we are, I forgot to mention this. We're on Dahl Ranch, uh, that is available from the official mod hub, and this is the largest uh, field on this map. It's it's that that huge. It's number six, uh, like like the whole whole of the map. 
and at first it seemed like a good idea but now this is a this is a safe file under uh, um, extermination I will move to another place with this farm that I usually don't show uh, in on YouTube but this time it seemed like the best option for uh, for, a, for a mod review and the mod spotlight yeah so as that again it might be old for now but again this is this is a mod that I will have to give uh, 10 out of 10 uh, it's it's absolutely awesome I love it to pieces uh, and I can't wait to use it on the new place where I'm moving from here. Uh, once I finished uh, canola harvest on this field, uh, it's going to be awesome. I defi I'm definitely going to take this uh, beast along for a ride, even though it, on here it is now just leased. Uh, but, but that's that's crazy good. I must have it simply. About the the flexi coil, <laughs> uh, do could we call it a chisel plow or something like that? So about that, don't even ask. I I don't remember where I got it. Uh, it could be from American Eagles modding or, or, or I don't know from some shady source while I don't promote those occasionally I visit shady sources for mods uh, and this could be one example to that uh, yeah so here's here's the new new Challenger uh, MT800 all series for all the series for everyone yeah so Thank you very much for uh, watching the video, uh, please don't forget to like, share, uh, subscribe, put down your thoughts in the comment and as I said, link in the description, you can grab that tractor for yourselves. Uh, have fun, see you later, bye bye.